Yellowstone National Park sits atop one of the largest volcanic systems on Earth, was hit by a massive earthquake on Tuesday, March 11. Millions of people were evacuated hours after the massive earthquake struck Yellowstone. A massive eruption from the Montana city sent lava rocks and gas toward Idaho, Wyoming and South Dakota. The scientists say Yellowstone National Park was in a state of crisis before the massive earthquake struck Yellowstone. The quake measured 8.6 on the Richter scale at 8.15 a.m. local time. The location is in the Norris Geyser Basin and Wyoming National Park, said Dr. Michael Poland, a USGS scientist. After a powerful earthquake struck the Yellowstone caldera, local authorities have reported at least 79 people seriously injured by small rocks falling on them. Rescuers are working hard to evacuate residents and tourists. Hiking trails hit by landslides caused by the earthquake. Local authorities have issued an emergency warning. Yellowstone volcano has the potential to erupt. Scientists and volcanologists from various agencies are currently closely monitoring the development of volcanic activity in Yellowstone. Recently, magma movement beneath Yellowstone has increased after the Yellowstone earthquake. There are fears that this is a major eruption that has the potential to be one of the largest disasters in history. We can't yet say for sure whether this will trigger a supervolcano eruption. But the signs of magma movement are very clear, said Michael Poland. If the Yellowstone supervolcano erupts, it would be a devastating event for the entire country, as geologists consistently give it the highest rating for the potential damage a volcano can cause. It's pretty clear that the states of Wyoming, Montana, and Idaho would suffer the most damage. Entire states would be covered in ash, killing livestock, crops, and a large number of people as well. If Yellowstone erupts, the worst-case scenario is that Yellowstone has a major eruption, the impact could be far-reaching. A major eruption could release millions of tons of ash into the atmosphere, which could lower global temperatures. The domino effect on the economy and human life could be devastating. Wyoming would suffer greatly if the Yellowstone volcano erupts in the same way it did millions of years ago. Wyoming, Colorado, Montana, and Idaho could all see three to four feet of ash at once. Said Michael Poland. Ashfall would be the worst thing to deal with. An eruption would produce a huge amount of ash and debris, which could be carried by the wind to South Dakota and surrounding states. Ashfall would have a severe impact on agriculture, infrastructure, and public health. Ashfall could damage crops, contaminate water supplies, and disrupt transportation and communication systems.